Hi, it's Rob from the Brush and Bulkham. This is going to be a very quick tutorial on how to paint the cows on night haunts in a dirty grey colour. So the first colour that we're going to use is Citadel Mechanica Standard Grey. I'm just going to give the whole of the cowl a nice coat of that. As I say, there's loads of different colours that you can do these cows. I'm just going to give a few examples just to get the variety going. But you can paint them in pretty much any colour you want. I'm going for more of a dirty and grimy kind of look to them, so sort of browns, greys, sort of black and really dark grey as well. Next up we're going to shade it using Citadel Nuln Oil. This will darken it up nicely, give it plenty of darkness in those recesses. Allow us to build up the colour again. Slightly off camera there, I'm sorry about that. Now these are on the part finished night haunts that I'm working on at the moment. It's the 10 chain rasps that you got from the Mortal Realms magazine. So as the tutorials go on, you'll see these getting a bit more finished off. So now we're going to reapply the Citadel Mechanicus Grey again, just to bring the colour back out. Now you want to leave the null oil in those recesses, and also any of the little bits where there's like a bit of a groove, or a bit of a dip in the material, it's not quite a, a deep and sharp recess, you want to leave some of the shade in there too. like so. So next up we're going to use a little bit of Citadel Dawnstone. I'm going to use this to highlight the cloak, or the cowl rather. And you're just going to do this the same as you did with the brown on the main edges of it, the areas that are going to catch the light just to bring out the details and make them stand out a little bit. Now finally we're going to add some Citadel Agraxair shade and you're just going to do a very thin layer of this over the whole thing. And all that will do is give it a slightly grubby look, a dirty brown colour but you'll still have all the shades and the highlights in there. You'll be able to see exactly what it is, it'll just look that little bit dirtier. Like so. And there you have the finished cowl. Thanks for watching. I hope you've enjoyed the video. And if you have, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any future content. Also, think about some of our other social media linked below. Thanks.